Right off the top for you tonight at 6, a series of fights in a Muskegon school. It involved pepper spray, an ambulance, and nearly a dozen students detained by police. 24-Hour News 8's Ken Kolker is live tonight in Muskegon with this story. Yeah, Brian and Sue, police say the fight got out of hand in the cafeteria just before noon today and that it could lead to some big trouble for some students. One witness says the fight involved at least 30 kids, while another said there were six or seven separate fights. People pushing each other, knocking people down, throwing food, pushing tables, throwing chairs. So far, of the 10 students brought to the police station, one will face a charge of either assault or being disorderly. And it's not clear how many will face school discipline, up to suspensions or expulsion. There'll be school discipline that takes place, and then there's also uh, the opportunity for civil infractions. It was just chaos everywhere. A school liaison officer tried to stop it on his own. And the freight got a little bit larger, and so additional uh, police officers were called in to help support. Police say they broke it up only after spraying students with mace. Some people did receive a gas, which helped disperse the crowd and calm the students down. School officials today promised a heavy police presence until spring break begins Thursday afternoon. What you're saying is this is a safe, still a safe place to go to school. Absolutely, as it is 99.9% .9 of the time. Police and school officials tell us they're still reviewing school surveillance video to determine whether other students could face criminal charges. Live in Muskegon, Ken Kolker, 24-Hour News 8.